What's up guys, Sleepy Jirachi here, and today we do this! We have brought the one and only, this is a super awesome event, Volcanion. Okay, see my beautiful Volcanion. We have brought Volcanion to Lumio's Press, which I heard was an event. And the lady is back, the lady that is typically not there. Finally, I got to know our editor-in-chief. She finished her research about the mythical Pokemon Volcanion and came back to the office. Now! Um, would you talk to her? Whoa! Sorry, I was so surprised. I've been looking for Volcanion for 15 years, and finally, finally, I met a trainer who's traveling with it. I traveled everywhere to gather the information about Volcanion and put together a memo. I'll let you read the memo, but just for you, because it's top secret. So guys, don't tell anyone. Which part of the memo do you want to- <laughs> This is basically the same event as the Hoopa event, if you didn't see that. Um, basically the same thing. On the XX day of the XX month, at Pokemon Daycare on Route 7, about the extraordinary power that Volcanion is said to possess. Oh, okay, it's like in a diary format. Dis discussed it with a top breeder who's very familiar with the ecology of Pokemon and drew the following deduction. In order to cause a steam explosion powerful enough to blow up mountains, the Pokemon must have an organ with extremely high temperature that can instantly vaporize water to steam. That kind of organ is unheard of in ecology of Pokemon, but Volcanion may use it. Is there another part of the memo you're interested in reading? Of course. In the fog. On the XX day of the XX month, at the Pokemon Center in Camp Freertown, interviewed a trainer who says he witnessed a Pokemon that could be Volcanion when he was standed, stranded in a mountain. According to the Pokemon, a huge Pokemon shadow suddenly appeared. Two huge arm-like limbs that could crush even the land extended from its back, and from their tips, something that looked like smoke belched out and made the fog around the Pokemon even thicker. The trainer said the Pokemon shadow slowly disappeared into the fog. It's like a Bigfoot mystery, you know? On the XX day of the XX month, at Cafe Kazune in Lumio City, in the southern part of the Kalos region, there seems to be a custom to revere Volcanion as a nation-building Pokemon. People seem to believe that a steam explosion caused by Volcanion created the plain where they live. As a matter of fact, a huge mountain range suddenly disappeared due to an unexplained explosion in that part of the region in the past. It looks like that's it. Volcanion seems to trust you. I want you and Volcanion to travel together as good partners to each other. And that's basically, um, that was the whole Volcanion event. Isn't that exciting? So just like Hoopa, Volcanion has an informational event that will explain stuff about him. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys learned from this. And I will see you all later. Make sure to leave a like. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. And goodbye.